Hey guys, Rogue General here. Today I'm super excited to share with you the one, the only in fact, Camel Armor mod for Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord. Now, I know I said in my next video I'd show Humphrey the Camel on the battlefield. And, well, I am keeping my promise. You can see me riding Humphrey here, and I will also be including some epic battle footage at the end. But the primary focus of this video will be installation instructions and demonstrating this mod. Now, for those of you who watched my previous video, you'll be aware of the fact that in Bannerlord, there are only three camel saddles in the entire game, compared to over a dozen for horses. That's not all though. While horses can get up to 50, 60, and even 75 chainmail and plate armor, the three camel saddles all have identical stats. They all have 10 leather armor. This is pretty disappointing, especially because I'm doing a desert playthrough with Humphrey the Camel. So I created this mod. What this mod does is it greatly increases the armor value of camel saddles and also converts them from leather armor to plate armor. So now your camels can benefit from plate armor bonuses. You can change the armor type back to leather armor and even change the armor numbers themselves using the configuration file in the mod. I'll go through all that later. Now this mod's installation instructions are straightforward. If you are interested in downloading and using this mod, I do recommend you watch at least the beginning portion of this video where I do a tutorial of sorts. So, installation instructions. Number one, download this mod from Nexus Mods or wherever else I decide to host it. I'll post links in the description below. Number two, extract this mod into your Bannerlord modules folder. You'll need 7-zip or a similar software to extract the zip file. If you're not sure how to find this location on your computer, I've put instructions on the screen so you can pause the video if you need to. Okay, now let's hop over to my Windows Explorer so you can visualize the next steps. Alright, we're on my desktop now. As you can see here, I've already downloaded and extracted the mod into my Bannerlord Modules folder. Here's a Camel Armor mod. I'll click into it and you will see a module data folder and a submodule.xml file. We're going to ignore this submodule file, no need to touch that. If we go into the module data folder, you'll see a config.xml file. If we want to modify this mod, you can open this with notepad and you can change these armor values to whatever you want for these three camel saddles. All right, so. Let's change these numbers to 10 armor, that's, that's the game default, 50 armor, and 1000. Now in the game, these camel saddles are treated as leather armor, but in this mod, I have changed them to type plate armor, so you can make full use of plate armor bonuses. If you would like to change it back to leather armor for some reason, you can just go ahead and type leather, and leather, second one should be capital, as you can see, and that will revert the material type back to leather armor. But for our testing purposes, I do want to keep them at plate armor, so we will go with that. And we save our changes. And now we are ready to jump into the game. So we have launched our game. Now all you need to do is click into the Mods tab over here and make sure that the Camel Armor mod is enabled. Now one quick note on mod compatibility. If it appears that the camel armor mod is not working, most likely there is another mod changing up item values which is causing the conflict. For example, I like to use the Armies of Calradia mod because it gives the Asrai faction some really cool heavy lancer camel troops, which is fun, but it also causes my mod not to work, which is not fun. To fix this, all you have to do is drag the camel armor mod all the way to the bottom of your mod load order. This will ensure that this mod will have the final say. Now the great thing is, with this load order, both the armies of Calradia and the Camel Armor mods work perfectly. This is because the Camel Armor mod is a very simple mod that changes very few things. So it will almost never cause another mod to break. All right, we're done here, now let's get into the game. All right, so we're back in the game. Now we can test to make sure that the changes we made have actually been applied. So if you remember the camel saddle, uh, we kept it at 10 armor. It is of type plate armor now, but that information is not gonna show on this tooltip. We go down here, the camel saddle with heavy load, 
it's at 50 armor. And the camel saddle with light load, it's at 1,000 armor. All right, so let's go ahead and check these values in battle. All right, we are in battle now. So after this skirmish, we're going to go ahead and test out these new armors. You know, it definitely seems like you're seated much higher on a camel than you are on a horse. Oh man, poor Humphrey, look at that blood. Also, did you guys know that Humphrey can't jump? Horses can jump in this game, but I guess camels can't. Just a fun little fact for you. Alright, so the battle is over, and now we can test our new camel armors. So we'll start off with the uh, just the regular camel saddle. So this is 10 armor. 40, oh wow, it's dead. Yeah, these are, all these guys are pretty wounded. Let's, let's hit this guy. So 40, uh, 40 damage. 40 damage. Again, just 10 armor. Let's take a look at the, uh, the light load. This should be 50 armor. Hold on. Oh, my bad. This is the 1,000 armor. That's why the, the arrows are breaking. <laughs> I don't know if you guys noticed. Just one damage, but over here, see, the arrow is actually literally just breaking. <laughs> uh, okay, let's take a look at the heavy load. I think this should have 50 armor. Yeah, only 21 damage, so you can you can see the comparison. Uh, 21 damage for 50 plate armor versus 40 damage if you only have 10 armor. All right, well that one's dead. This one has, yeah, that, that's just the default armor. And let's go back to the, uh, the light load. <laughs> Two damage, that, that's a headshot. Two damage for a headshot. <laughs> but again, that's 1,000 armor. You're not gonna be, you're not gonna probably wanna use this value in the actual game. What's more realistic is probably the 50 plate armor. Like this one. 21 damage only. And again, you can bump these numbers up to whatever you want. 40 damage. Oh, he just died. <laughs> this is the default armor. Poor Humphreys. And I'm out of arrows. So we've tested that the camel armor mod is working. That's all for this video. You know, I've already got an idea for another mod in mind. I'll give you a hint, it has to do with Humphrey and War Camels, so do subscribe if you want to be kept in the loop. Alright guys, thanks for watching, goodbye.